हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू माय चैनल आई होप यू आर फीलिंग वेल प्लीज लाइक एंड शेयर दिस वीडियो एंड आई हैव अ रिक्वेस्ट टू यू ऑल सब्सक्राइब माय यूट्यूब चैनल टू मैनी व्यूवर्स वाचिंग माय वीडियोस विदाउट सब्सक्राइब माय यूट्यूब चैनल सो प्लीज सब्सक्राइब माय यूट्यूब चैनल एंड वॉच दिस वीडियो टिल एंड फॉर स्पोर्टिंग मी सो लेट स्टार्ट टू द इन्फॉर्मेशन दीज आर सम अपडेट्स ऑन दिन आर इफ यू वॉन्ट टू सी द लेटेस्ट इन्फॉर्मेशन ओपिनियंस and rumors about Iraqi dinar then visit this site www.tanaropinions.com the governor of the central bank of iraq ali mosen al alaq noted on sunday the possibility of opening new channels for external transfer of hard currency and raising the rate of daily transfers this came during the periodic meeting of governmental and private banks which was held in baghdad and witnessed a discussion of a number of projects that are consistent with the requirements of the economic reality in Iraq Al Alaq stressed that these projects establish a qualitative shift in the Iraqi economy and enhance its stability revealing at the same time the project to establish a Riyada bank and the project to establish a loan guarantee company that facilitates the lending process for medium small and micro enterprises He referred to the direction of the Central Bank of Iraq in cooperation with the government and the contribution of the financial banking and business sectors to establish a city of financial and business center in Iraq. Al Alaq participated in the discussions put forward by a group of banks regarding the Central Bank's initiatives. The relationship between banking institutions and customers and what is related to developing mechanisms for entering the electronic platform for selling foreign currency on the surface iraq appears to have achieved a measure of stability the country finally has a functioning government after a year long political vacuum terrorist violence has fallen to its lowest rate since the 2003 us invasion however percent and dollar is happening behind the curtain for those of us outside of iraq looking in Everything appears to be fine and for the most part it is but let's get real with what's really happening. Article Iraq is quietly falling apart Iran is silently and quietly setting up financial systems of failure for Iraq starting with the 2023 budget that Iraq cannot afford. The ATM I cannot comment on it because I never saw a newer ATM maybe operated like I told you before. but they're not loaded with smaller categories because they didn't even print it they have picture of them but they didn't print it it's a waiting game this is important guys the cbi in cooperation with banks launches large financial projects their budget goes backwards with the current rate matter of fact they are working directly with egypt to develop businesses egypt has made a cooperation with bank of iraq to develop smes entrepreneurship The currency is not going to go into an international market as it is at 1310. It's going to have to have an international acceptable rate and calculation applied to it. Buying materials at 1310 to build a country is going to take hundreds and hundreds of trillions of dinar. But if you were to move it to a 1 to 1 basis it's so much cheaper. If you moved it to 2 to 1, 3 to 1, 4 to 1, 5 to 1, 6 to 1 you can see how cheap it's going to be to buy those products the real effect of exchange rate is going to be determined to see where we are as our investment we are in the middle of the month where walking six bank friend aki told us those new iraqi atm machines would have a different currency in them firefly boots on the ground is literally camping outside of those atms we believe that's the next hot spot for our investment The ATMs have a lot more than you can imagine. It's not just a different currency. The president of the republic is reviewing the budget. He has 15 days to sign/ratify the budget or IT automatically becomes law. He has said on numerous occasions he plans to sign IT.